Hi everyone. Very soon it's going to be Thanksgiving in the United States. And that's a time when people get together and they uh, talk about the things that they're thankful for in their life and they eat food and they celebrate. And although it may look a little different this year because we may not be able to get together with all of the family that we'd like to, we still have lots to be thankful for all around the world. So I'm going to share my screen with you and we're going to read a story about being thankful. And it's called Thankfulness. What is thankfulness? There are many things to be happy about. Maybe you have a cute new baby sister. Maybe your grandma has moved closer to you. Maybe someone has baked your favorite cookies. Thankfulness means having good thank you feelings about something. When you're thankful, you feel grateful for what you have. Thankfulness at school. It's lunchtime at school. You cannot wait to eat your sandwich. It's your favorite kind. You sit down and open your lunch. Your sandwich is not there. You forgot to put it in your lunch bag. Your friend sees what ha what sorry. Your friend sees what's happened. She gives you half of her sandwich. You are thankful for your friend's kindness. Thankfulness for someone's kindness. You and your friends are racing on the playground. You fall and hurt your arm. The school nurse cleans your arm. She puts on a bandage. She talks to you about how you're feeling. She makes you feel better. You're thankful that she's there. Thankfulness for your friends. Your best friend is great. You do everything together. She likes to do the same things you do. She laughs at your jokes. When something is bothering you, she listens while you talk. She cheers you up when you're sad. You're thankful to have a friend like her. Thankfulness for your parents. Your mom and dad work hard at their jobs. They keep your house clean. They make sure you have good food to eat. They help you stay safe. They do things to make you happy. You're thankful that your parents take care of you. You're thankful that they love you. Thankfulness for your family. Sometimes you fight with your sister. Sometimes you get mad at your mom and dad. Even so, you love your family. They cheer you up when you are sad. They help you when you are scared. They teach you new things. You are thankful that they are your family. Thankfulness and your neighborhood. In the summer, you go swimming at the pool. You check out books from the library. You and your friends play in the park. These are great places to go. You know that some kids are not so lucky. Their neighborhoods do not have such nice places. You are thankful to live in a neighborhood that does. Thankfulness for someone's help. Sometimes people go out of their way to help others. Maybe someone has helped you with your reading. Maybe someone helped you learn something new. Maybe a neighbor helped you fix your bike. Maybe a friend cheered you up when you were sad. You feel thankful when somebody, someone does something nice for you. Thankfulness for everything. Take a look at the people, places, and things around you. What do you have to be thankful for? You can show thankfulness by saying thank you, or you can give someone a thank you hug, or you can do something nice for someone else. Thankfulness makes the world a brighter place. So maybe you can say, think of some things that you can be thankful for. Is there somebody that has done something nice for you or someone that's helped you when you needed it? Um, or someone maybe who gave you a hug when you were sad. There's lots of people and things that we can be thankful for. And we don't have to wait until Thanksgiving to remember them, do we? No, we could do that any day. All right, I'm thankful for you, my friends. I'm thankful that you watch my videos and I'm thankful to meet some of you. All right, have a great day. Bye-bye.